I'm going to show you how to make your materials more realistic with one click in Blender. And the best part of this all is that it's free. So let's jump into it. Let me show you how to install it. It's an add-on. And because if I show you, it'll be a bit easier because it's a little bit confusing. So I'll take you through the steps, show you what the add-on is, where to get it, and how to use it. So stick around for the video. Make sure you subscribe and let's get into it. Okay, so this is the add-on. That's what it's called. I'll leave a link to it in the description so you can download it. It says your name a fair price, but, but you can just put zero and download it if you want to donate one dollar or more. Go ahead. And yeah, I know that the person who developed it would appreciate your donation. So feel free to do that. Once you've downloaded it, you will get these two. So just download them both. And then what you want to do is I'll show you. So download them. Then it should come up here. Your downloads. So yeah. And then what you want to do is this one. Don't unzip it. But this one unzip it. Okay. So just right click and extract. But don't unzip this one. Because this is the actual add-on. This is the, the files. Okay. So now when we blend it, when we want to install it, what you're going to do is click edit preferences install like any other add-on find it so this one is called quick graph click on it you can see i've already installed it to come up here okay and this is what it is and then this thing will be blank so this is the other file what you do is you just click on it so yeah and then it'll be your downloads and then it will be here yeah, mine was there click click and then accept and then it will come up here yeah. otherwise if this is blank you won't have any of the imperfection files so let's show you let me show you how to use it let's go here yeah. okay so simple material let me just add a color to it so so you I'll make it Say blue. Actually, let's make it like a white, make it darker, and then bring the metallic up. Okay. And then the roughness down. Okay. Now you can see this material is perfect. Right. So now we're going to add imperfections or like make it more photorealistic without having to play around with more shaders all you do is hit n on your keyboard so n open this up and then go here and then to items and it'll be a qrl then all you do is you hit refresh and then these are all the imperfections so check your fingerprints click on it add roughness and look how easy that is and then you can scale it you can select the amount and then if you want to change it there we go look how nice that looks now and you can bring the scale so you can see there's so many you can add and it just makes your material look much better with one click literally one click play around with it and you can just delete one you don't want so you can stack them so you can see i can add this one then i can go this one so it stacks them on top of each other because you can see and if you don't want one you just click it so free add-on great add-on i thought i'd share it with you guys hopefully you enjoyed the video make sure you subscribe and i'll see you in the next one